Hundreds of people gathered at Monument Square. Undocumented immigrants, DACA recipients and supporters of the program, which allows people who came here as children to work and get an education without the threat of deportation. The crowd marched through the streets by Speaker Paul Ryan's office. They want him to help pass legislation to make DACA permanent instead of allowing it to be phased out. The DACA recipients I spoke to say they are worried because they give their information to the government. Now they fear they could be deported. We willingly, knowingly gave up that information to the government. We trusted them and this is what we have to show for that. That hurts. Nayeli Rondon is a college graduate and became a DACA recipient in 2012. She doesn't know what's next and joins about 800,000 other people nationwide facing similar uncertainty. It's really devastating because I grew up here. I came here at the age of three. This is a country that I know and that I love. My hope is that if possible, if Congress does do their job in, in the next six months, that we can get something permanent and something good because we're not, we're not criminals. In Racine, Ben Hutchison, WISN 12 News.